Hi, I'm Samantha Alexander, reporting Life for Kids First, and today I'm reviewing Ricky and the Flash. Ricky and the Flash is a movie about a rocker mom, played by Meryl Streep, who leaves her three kids at a young age to pursue her dreams to be a rock star. She comes back, though, many years later to console her daughter that's going through a hard breakup with a husband that left her for another woman. This movie teaches you about family, teaches you about love, teaches you about how feelings can be handled in different ways, and most of all, it teaches you about second chances. Out of all the messages in this movie, these four messages stood out to me the most. This one was a very fun movie to watch, not only because it was funny, but because it was a very common problem, but with a funnier twist. This is one of the reasons why I liked it. It made the movie even better how some people can relate to a mom walking out on her kids or about someone missing in your family. The second this movie started, I got super excited, not only to see an amazing actress playing the main role, but also to see the amazing Meryl Streep singing and playing an electric guitar. It, this got me ready for the great movie I was about to see. Besides Meryl Streep being born for basically any role, especially this one, there's a lot of there's a lot more actors in this movie that I would like to talk about, including Mamie Gummer, Ricky Springfield, and Sebastian Stan. Mamie Gummer played the role of Julie, Ricky's daughter, um, the daughter that was going through a hard breakup with a husband that left her for another woman. She was awesome in this role. And her character seemed like a very hard character to play, only because she was very sad and she had a lot of mood swings, so I think she did perfect for this role. The next actor I want to talk about is Rick Springfield, who played the role of Greg, Ricky's boyfriend. He played a very generous and loyal boyfriend to Ricky, even when Ricky played hard to get. And I think that he did great for this role, and he's an amazing actor. The last actor I want to talk about is Sebastian Stan, who played one of Ricky's most open sons. He was basically the only son that wanted to see Ricky after she walked out and came back many years later. And I think he was an essential part to this movie. I'm giving this movie 4 out of 5 stars because the storyline seemed to move a little bit fast in my opinion, but other than that, it was great. And I'm recommending it for ages 13 through 21, only because um, there was some strong language and a lot of kissing going on. If you like Rock and Roll and Meryl Streep, I recommend you go see this movie immediately. Samantha Alexander reporting for Kids First. Bye!